good morning students uh, in class 9th we have to cover many topics and uh, the topics will be which have to cover uh, computer system types of hardware and software then operating systems networking and multimedia the networking means computer networking and multimedia cyber safety cyber safety and uh, then word excel powerpoint ms office package word ms word ms excel which is a spreadsheet software powerpoint and then at last we have to study about programming language that is python python or scratch right scratch is optional so we will study only python we will focus on python only because in class 10th and 11th 12th we will study python only today in this video i am going to start the very first topic that is computer system about computer right what is a computer system computer how we can define computer how we can define computer so computer we can say that computer is an electronic device which takes the input from the user processes it and gives the output this is how we can define a computer system it takes the input from the user processes it and gives the result as an output that is a computer system the next point is functioning of a computer how it functions so it functions by taking the input from the user processing on the data and giving the result as an output giving the desired result as an output and at last it stores the data also you know, after processing when result will come out what it does then with the result it stores the result at some place so that means it stores the data right so this is functioning of a computer then is what are the different functional component of a computer system what are the different functional component of a computer system so as i told you in functioning of a computer is it takes the input process it and gives the desired result so what uh, will be the functional component of a computer input unit to input to take the in, to take take the input from the user input unit then processing unit then output unit which gives the output and storage unit so these four are functional component of a computer system input unit process unit output unit and storage unit where it stores permanently that is storage unit so these four are functional component of a computer system now input unit what are the input units in in, in input unit we can say that input units are those units through which we can gives input to the computer such as keyboard scanner mouse tablet graphic tablet all of these are input unit known as through which we can gives the input to the computer now process unit what are the different processing unit in a computer system so process unit means which processes the data alu cu and memory here in cpu memory means register small which stores small amount of data right so these are processing unit alu cu 
and register and then is output unit the unit from which we can take the output from the computer uh, as for example printer plotter monitor monitor all of these are giving us output result so that is output unit now next come to the processing unit separately what is processing unit and how it processes the data by the help of different cpu components so what are the different cpu components alu cu and register alu means arithmetic logic unit which performs arithmetic calculations and logical operation which performs arithmetic calculation and logical operations that is arithmetic and logic unit then is cu which is control unit c for control control unit a unit which controls all the operation of the computer all the processing of the computer which controls that is control unit and then is register or memory in a cpu this register is different from memory of a computer which is ram right it is different from that ram register register resides in a cpu only and it stores the instructions for execution it stores the instructions for execution now next we will see how this cpu works by the help of alu cu and register by a diagram thank you and stay safe